Hello and welcome to tonight's live sizing and styling guide. If you are catching this part, you are probably catching the replay. Make sure to comment hashtag replay. Let us know that you were here and that you saw this. We are going to do our little bit of maintenance stuff here. And as you hop on, make sure to say hi. Let us know that you are watching. I hope everybody had a fabulous Christmas. Um, I know we are all just trying to get back in the swing of things, but it's just seeming like um, it's going to take a while. I think uh, over here, at least, we are just not there yet. The kids are going crazy and um, it's a lot of uh, togetherness. So <laughs> I think our household's a little bit crazy right now, as I'm sure everybody else's are um, as well. So hey, everybody. Hi, Tiffany. Hey, Carol. Welcome. Welcome, you guys. I hope you all had a Merry Christmas and um, tomorrow it is the last day of 2019, the last day of the decade. So we are excited to um, do our last live of the year and get things kind of I guess set and kicked off for uh, 2020, uh, where we hope to have a whole lot of new and big things kind of coming this way. And it's just exciting. So we are pleased um, to be here. Let me go ahead and do my little bit of maintenance here. And let me see. I don't know what everybody has planned for tomorrow. We are going to a friend's house for New Year's Eve, at least for a few hours, while our kids can manage it. I tend to not like to keep them up till midnight if it's not necessary. <laughs> so that is kind of our plan. I hope everybody has some big fun plans going on. Um, I need, I didn't put earrings on, did I? You got these out for me and I didn't ever put them on. So we have fun stuff today and this is a little bit of a smaller live as I put my earrings on um, <laughs> because Liberty's here with us. Hi. And Christine's on the back end, so <laughs> everyone is here. Um, but today's live is a little bit smaller, and you know, I'm still figuring out like the cadence of deliveries, and then between the holidays, it's really odd. I'm like, I placed orders almost two weeks ago, and they're not here yet, but I think that everybody's just a little bit off with um, the holidays and holiday hangover. Holiday right? hangover. That's what she called it. Yes. Like, That's clever. I like that. that. Is, well, I mean, and it's not even like a hangover, it's just the holidays. Yes. We're like, whew, recovery. Yes. So, um, um, we, tonight's live is going to be a little bit smaller, but we are bringing you some fun new goodies. So I'm really excited to share them with you. And then, of course, we will be back to normal schedule yeah. with lives next week and going forward um, and just figuring everything out. So, um, so I'm just looking at everybody hop on. Hi, Diane. Yes. Happy New Year, everybody. Hey, Teresa. I hope that if you all wear um, any of your goodies from the boutique tomorrow night that you share pictures. We love, love, love to see your pictures. It was so fun over the holidays seeing everybody's um, goodies in action. Um, Aw, uh, Sherry, I'm just seeing your comment about your sweater. I'm so glad it made it in time. I know Christine was like rushing to the post office to get that to you, and I'm glad it made it there. So, hey, everybody. I'm just scrolling back on to see all of you who are on. Um, Thank you, Katie, for sharing. Hey, Corey. Hey, Cheryl. Welcome, welcome. So, all right. Well, we are going to go ahead and get started here. Yes. Do you want me to start? Sure. Okay, and I see Christine already posted some details about this. She's ahead of the game while I'm over here being a <laughs> chatty Kathy. Um, so this is a new dress that I'm excited to share with you guys. I absolutely love this. This is a Swiss dot material. I'm sure you guys have probably had things in this or felt this material or, or seen it at least in the past, but it's just very cool because it has that soft texture and that Swiss dot, which is just really lovely. It's just a really great um, fabric combination. So this is called the First Date Tiered Midi Dress. And I'm about, just so you know my stats, I'm about a size 6, 8, probably for sure an 8 after the holidays. <laughs> And all my cookies. Um, but I am about a size 6, 8. I am in my true size small here. It fits comfortably. This fabric does have stretch to it. I was a little bit worried it might not, but it does. So it is more fitted in the sleeve. I would say, say stay true to size for sure in this one. Um, but I just love the fit of this. And you know, I was throwing on different layers and we were like, it's just pretty by I itself. Know. I said, let it speak for itself. Yeah, because that's what I Luke just said. It by so itself. it's available in this gray, and then you're gonna see it in Lib's color. There is a little variation between um, the curvy sizes and 
and regular sizing where this one um, in, well, not regular sizing. We don't like to call it that, but the small through XL um, has the three quarter length sleeve. And then you'll see it a little bit different on lips, but it hits me just below the knee. It has a nice waistline that hits on a little bit above my natural waistline. So this here is about my natural waist. This hits me above that. So just something to reference that it isn't intended to be down on your natural waist. It does sit a little bit higher up. Which but, I think actually like helps to feel like it hides more tummy. Yeah, I agree. Know? It's a little more flattering because it doesn't yep. hit just at that area and then kind of give you that pooch. So it's a really nice um, fit here. So that is the first date dress here in the gray. Oh, and I want to show you my earrings. We're going to show you a fun variety today of earrings. I know everybody um, snatched up earrings uh, throughout the holidays. You guys really loved those. So we are bringing you some solids in the faux uh, leather earrings and then as well as some that have a cool um, kind of embossed texture to them that I hopefully you can see. You, yeah. yeah. So hopefully Lib can show you those up close, but there is a wide variety of colors in these. So make sure to scope them out. And again, they're just four bucks. So it's a great deal to get some fun earrings um, and things, you know, at a great cost that you can wear with a lot of different Absolutely. outfits. So, okay, well, I'm going to get off camera and let Lib go. Okay. So I have mine paired with this lovely, I mean, you all have seen this. Many of you have actually snatched this up, but this is this gorgeous, um, so many beautiful colors in this. In fact, I can't believe one hasn't gone home with me, but it's a great way to showcase the teal that is in this, but also this teal that is in this dress. As Rachel had mentioned, it is that uh, dot Swiss, right? Dot Swiss fabric. Mm -hmm. So it's just absolutely beautiful, and I love this. And in the curvy in this one, we actually have a nice generous sleeve. It's not three-quarter length, but for those of us that do want to keep our arms covered, it's great for um, covering arms. So um, I also like the way that the, the length on this of where it's hitting. I just have it on with a classic black flat, but you could definitely do something champagne if you wanted to wear, you know, different, uh, kind of pull in some different colors with this. Heck, if you're feeling really, I mean, it would be even fun with a great nude shoe too. Um, but I really, as I had mentioned, you know, I'm a little bit bustier, so this does hit right underneath my bust. Um, but then it also gives you that nice movement in the stomach area where you're not like, um, you know, it's hiding your stomach, but it's also not like looking like a pregnancy top, if that makes sense. And I know that that's definitely something us curvy girls want to make sure that like, we're not wearing something that's like, is this a preg is this, this actually make me look larger than I am? So uh, I love the length on this. I love the color. It's very vibrant. It's that fantastic jewel tone teal that is just absolutely beautiful. And I'm really loving this. I also um, love, love the sleeve length because it's just long enough that it covers any of that funky stuff. You also don't have to shave your armpits in this dress, <laughs> but it's a short sleeve dress. I am not much of a shaver, so my dear husband. Um, <laughs> but that's what I did want to mention that these earrings have, uh, so there's two different kinds. You saw the pebble, which is like the faux leather. Uh, leathering and you'll see some more of that type tonight and then this is like an emboss that just has the beautiful diamonds in there and I know that the um, holiday earrings went over so so well so it was very smart for Rachel to bring in these um, neutral tone ones that are just like easier for everyday wear church wear going out with the girls that type of thing and they're just they're fun and they're funky and we're loving on them so um, these are just fun ones so um, if anybody has any questions about this one uh, just put it in the comments and we'll be able to help you with that. But for now, I'm going to change into my next top. All right. Well, next up we have another dress or swing tunic, however you prefer to wear these. Um, I will say they're a little bit long for a swing tunic. I'd say familiar maybe length with some swing tunics that we had in the past, um, or it's almost knee length and you can get away with wearing these as a dress or something with leggings. So I had requests for prints. You know, I was on this wild spree of like solids um, when I kind of like went on my own. And now I am on the hunt for some fun prints to bring you guys to pair with some of the great cardigans and other pieces that we have have um, or that you guys have already purchased in stock. So here is a beautiful one. You're going to see this in another colorway as well. Um, and it is just this gorgeous mix of medallions and different prints and great colors that make it something real that's really versatile that you can wear with a lot of different things. It is baby suede. So it is super soft, nice and stretchy, has great stretch and movement to it. And like I said, I'm 5'7 and this hits me just above the knee. So it's a nice length, but I can easily throw on 
on a pair of leggings with this and turn it into something that's more like a tunic style. It has pockets. As you can see, I want to get close so you guys can kind of get a good look there at the colors in this, but it has some really pretty shades of kind of some rosy um, or like corally lighter pinks and then also the red. So I paired it with a pair of red earrings to kind of bring that tone out and make them pop. And then some of your classic kind of um, it's not even, it's more of like a light tan or a little bit of like a camel color in there. So you could layer this or wear this with like a camel color legging. Um, and then of course, just your navies. So this is a really pretty one. I absolutely love this. Love the length of it. Love the fit of it. Again, I am in my true size small. It has long sleeve and the sleeves I would say are generous on them. Not super long, but I like a longer sleeve and they definitely do the trick and um, there's plenty of room in that. And of course, things like this are nice because you can kind of push your sleeve up you can layer these differently and get a lot of wear um, in them throughout the winter months so these are really cute and of course it's something that you can carry into spring too so I am absolutely loving this and then like I said I paired it with the red earring and this is one that um, has that diamond emboss on it uh, like Liberty was kind of telling you about if you can see that something I love about these is how lightweight they are so they don't like tug on my ears and I feel like in my younger days I wore a lot of really heavy earrings that really pulled on my earlobes and these are just so nice because they're so light weight and I basically don't even know that they're there um, but they're just cute and they're that fun pop of color and I even notice when I take pictures and I don't wear earrings and then when I take them with the earrings I'm like it just kind of adds that little something I mean I don't do a whole lot of accessorizing you guys know I am kind of in my basic bracelets all the time and same necklace kind of thing but I love the little pop from the earrings so Rachel, would you super say, cute does this read navy or black because I think you can do either with it um it has both in yeah. it actually it has black in it and then it's got a navy that's more of like a royal navy Navy, yeah. I would say, um, than like your deep tone navy, but it definitely has black in it. So if you're somebody that wants to pair it with black, you can absolutely wear this with a pair of black pants or black leggings and pull that out or with black boots. You know, I chose brown, not even realizing, I guess, that it had no, the, the black brown in works it. Too. I just wanted yeah. to mention, I think black looks good. But yeah, perfect, absolutely. So. You're right. I didn't even see that down in there. But yeah, there's black mixed through all of this. So it's just beautiful. So you're going to get to see this on Lib in another colorway. And here we are. Here she is. Ta -da! Oh, I really like this. <laughs> so I do want to mention, I have this on in the two, right, Chris? Yes, you okay. do. Okay, uh, because this came up to a two in this. So it just gives you an idea of how it fits. And I think it's a generous enough fit that it fits well. Uh, in fact, there are pockets. Of course, I have to show you that there's pockets. Um, but a nice, generous pocket, too. Like, my, like I know that sometimes there's some pockets in something, but they're useless pockets. These are deep enough pockets that are actually good for something. Um, but I really love this. You know, um, I could have worn this with a brown as well because there's definitely some of those earthier tones that read in this print um but i have worn it with a black boot here and you could definitely wear this with a i would if it's chillier here so i probably would wear it with a legging uh but you could also do a heel with this and this would be nice this would even be something nice for like a winter wedding winter into spring too when you want to have something that's covering your arm um but do you see cheryl's comment asking no. about the sleeve stretch Oh, for your arm, Cheryl, sleeve stretch in the upper arm. Let me just give you, there's nice stretch. There's nice stretch here. So you're not going to be, with, without it being floppy, you know, so there's a good, there's a good stretch in there. So I don't think you have a concern about, you know, um, arm being too tight. It doesn't feel too tight under the arms uh, or in the arm as well. Um, but I just love this print. Is this just so fun? I love the burgundy tones and you know, I am a rose gold person. I love rose gold. So I've actually paired this beautiful rose gold earring with this outfit, which is one of the embossed earrings, uh, the faux leather earrings. And Rachel's absolutely right. These are not heavy. I love these type of earrings. Um, and you're right. When you put them on, you kind of forget that they're there because they're definitely not too heavy, uh, but they're just like a fun statement. But I love this, um, both of the colorways. Now this one is a curvy exclusive, right? Nope, that, no, that okay. one is available in all through this 2X. This is through 2X in this the one, so... it's only small, medium, large. Okay, I don't know if you heard, Rachel, but the one that she had tried on is small, medium, large. And then the one that I have on in this color is uh the whole is the whole run from small to 2X. But as you can tell, it's not a too tight 2X. You know, right. I'm always very, very frank with you guys on how things fit because I know I want them to fit properly for you so you're not shipping things back and forth or like, oh, I don't know if I'll wear that now, you know? But um, plenty of room, great pockets in this, and I, um, 
this is just real fun a great piece to take you into springtime as well and between a medium and large which would you suggest if it flows enough to stay with a medium, medium. i would go with the medium suzanne yeah, yeah i would go with the medium but on one more quick look just on these beautiful rose gold um and just an up close of some of the fantastic patterning that is happening in this top but yes those are two really fun pieces with good pockets i know i keep talking about that but they're great <laughs> pockets all right i love the teal in that one too there's just so many different little pops of color okay so next up um i am in this fun new camo anorak i always am like am i saying that right jacket so those of you who had a vest um or got one of the vests that we have had this year this is this very similar fabric to that um and it's now available in this cute camel jacket it just features a lot of fun details like your little buttons um and then of course a little zipper pocket here i think it's a faux zipper but it's just for the fun detail again that you get in this two working pockets here on the front and then it zips and button closure now this is again where we like to just be honest with you um and i am in my true size small oh something else that's nice about this is that if you want to cinch this in at your waist so you get a little bit more shape on the inside it has that little secret cincher that you can kind of pull in and add some definition to your waistline so on that note let's talk about these i am in my true size small here and it's quite fitted um i have it layered over a long sleeve tee which i will show you guys but it is a fitted small. So I'm going to say that this is going to be a suggested size up one to two in this, depending on your desired fit. Um, but just to give you a real good idea of what true to size is, um, it's, it's definitely more fitted on me. So if I was only going to wear this open and I'm okay with a little bit of a snugger sleeve, then you can stay true to size, but I would be most comfortable going up one to a size or to a medium. So this is going to probably be for be preferred for somebody who is a true size like extra small um but these are so stinking cute i absolutely love this jacket it's just really nice nice weight easy to throw on um it's going to be great into spring and just that great layering piece that is really cute and of course fun we all love camo i love these little collars that you can kind of pop and and it's one of my favorites sleeve length on them i'd say that they're a what a sleeve length should be on a jacket like this not exceptionally long but again going up a size or two you're going to get more length in there um, so that's definitely going to be an option uh, for you. I would say for sure go up. Okay, I'm going to take this off real quick and show you guys, um, talk about this tee. And then I'm going to give you, I'm going to let you see it in a different color in a little bit because black's always hard. If I can get my my bracelets out of this jacket. Oh, it's nice because these um, snap too. So something I'd love to do is kind of roll up sleeves on my jacket um, and these unsnap. So that makes it really easy to adjust them. So we have some new fitted tees um, in because I had these requested. So we do have a few different options um, in curvy sizing for your solid tees and layering pieces. And I know that fitted doesn't tend to always be something that curvy um, women prefer. So I opted to not get fitted tees in curvy sizes at this time. If it's something that you guys would like, let me know and I can definitely look into it, um, you know, or get bring those into the shop for you. But there are definitely um, solid layering or under layer options for you. So make sure to take a peek at those. But in fitted tees, I've had requests. So I brought in two different ones. There's a V-neck and there is a um, a uh, just a crew neck in the same tee. This is a premium fabric. If you tried the fitted tees that I've already had, they were more of a cotton fabric and I am okay with cotton, but I liked the feel of this premium fabric a little bit more. Um, it has a nicer stretch to it and I think it just lays a little bit nicer and then also washes and wears better. So that was one of those things that I kind of wanted to adjust some and bring in some more options for you. So black is available in the two, the V-neck and the round neck. Um, and then it's also going to be in the round neck, this really pretty blue shade of blue. Um, it looks a little bit brighter, I think, on camera than what it is, but it's probably the black throwing it off, as well as a teal. And then you guys are going to see um, another one in the V-neck. So those are just a few options to kind of get us going on these tees, see how you guys like them, how the fits are, and that kind of thing. Um, but I, I really like these. I like the fit of them, so I'm in my true size small. Um, it is more of a fitted tee, but it doesn't, like, hug me super close, so I definitely have room in them. And then I have a paired here with the gray can cans um, in the my true size and can cans um, is tends to be like a nine. Uh, but in this particular can can, I like to size down one in them. Now that has been 
something that's varied for some depending on how you carry your weight. So I'd say stay true to size and your can can size to be safe. Um, but I think going from there, we want to do our ampersand avenue drawing. So if y'all bought ampersand avenue during that fun promotional period that we were, well, we weren't running ampersand avenue actually, um, sponsored the giveaway. So we have this fun backpack here, um, that so many of you, I don't know if Christine counted how many entries there were, uh, but there were a lot. How many? 78. 78 entries, you guys, to win um, the Ampersand Avenue backpack. And it is just so stinking cute. Uh, if you didn't get in on this time to enter to win one, there will probably be another time that we're going to do the same promo so that way you guys can get an opportunity to win that backpack. So, Liv, you want to draw a name for me? Sure. All right. So we have everybody's names in here. Um, Christine wrote these all out today and put them in here. I haven't even looked, so Liberty's going to <laughs> pull. Oh, goodness. And we will see who's, who's the winner. Kimberly Seaton? Satan? Seaton. Oh my gosh. If your last name is not Satan, I'm sorry. <laughs> Kimberly? Kimberly. I don't know if you're watching. Drum roll. <laughs> drum no, roll. I, no, it says, Arlene said, drum roll. <laughs> Maybe she's not watching tonight. Obvious. I mean, like, Maybe she's she not. very well could not be watching tonight. Do you have the list in front of you? Yeah. S-E-A-T-O-N, right? Uh -huh. Kimberly C and S-E-A-T-O-N, you are the winner of the backpack. So make sure to reach out to me to claim it and we'll get that set off to you. But thank you all for participating. It was so fun. Um, and I hope you all are loving your Ampersand Avenue hoodies and goodies um, because their stuff is just awesome and worth every penny. So it's fun to be able to do promos like that and especially have Ampersand kind of get involved and um, sponsor something like that. So, so fun. So yes, congrats to Kimberly. Hopefully she sees this. Um, and and she'll make sure to claim her backpack. So I think Lib's gonna come on out. Yeah. And I'm gonna go change. Okay. I've got another great winter esque. Um, and so this is this very similar style that you just saw on Rachel and I in that baby suede. But this is the, uh, uh, it's the DIY, not DIY, DTY. Um, but not like a slinky, it's a nice weight of this. Um, and I love the gray blue that we have in here, the neutral, this beautiful mauve, uh, or if you're Canadian, mauve. Um, but I love, I love this print. It's fun. It's easy. I have it paired here with one of the fantastic scarves that's already in the shop. Um, so you can see how like a piece you might already have goes nicely for something if you want it to be a little bit warmer for winter. Um, but let me just take this off so you have an idea of what the neckline is like. Uh, it's nice and high, so that's always something that I appreciate because if you don't, if you want to have something that's very nice and modest, which is we saw a lot of those types of things in the Agnes and Dora items, this is one that where you're going to keep that modesty if that's something that you are, um, you know, something that's important to you. Two beautiful pockets, great length on here. I just have the black boot on here again. Once again, I'm thinking to myself, this is great for a winter wedding. This is great for work. This is great for church. Um, I really like this. And it's got a nice weight to it. So I have this one on in the three. I had the other one on in a two. So I would say they fit similar, which means that last one that I had on was a little bit more roomy, which is the intended kind of, you know, we talk about pizza and French fry. So that was more of that pizza fit. Uh, this still has an A-line to it, but it also is, is just a little less roomy than the last one that I had on. But I absolutely love this. Um, good length, good length in the sleeve. Um, and for those of you that may not know, I'm like a size 20, 22. I'm airing more on like the 20, um, but I typically wear a 3X in all of the items. Um, but that's also because I like to not let everybody know what's going on underneath. I like to like leave some things to the illusion I suppose um I do want to mention that there are classic black um of these embossed ones that are in the shop which is fantastic because these go with everything so I know they're going to go fast but I just wanted to mention to you how pretty those are and kind of give you an idea very close up of what those look like um, and how versatile that those can be with many things you have. And as Rachel had mentioned earlier, you'll see some more throughout this live, but they're just a great add-on piece for only a $4 price point too. So I love it. And I love the colors in this. Let me just get close so that you have a really good idea of um, kind of some of the detailing in this fabric. And then you can also see how nice the cream is and then also that blue gray. Um, but you could definitely wear this with... Um, 
you know, a cream sweater over top or black over top. This would even be cool with like a gray boot. I know I have some fun gray boots that this would be really fantastic with. Um, but just a great piece and not a slinky version of this type of fabric. It's definitely forgiving and then also very flattering. So two Fs we like. All right. I really like this one a lot. So write this down if you're taking notes. Do we have the barb about pockets? Barb. It does. It has two great deep pockets. In fact, you know, I have to tell you something. This is kind of funny. I was at my parents' house the other day and my mom had one of her pockets on a dress like out of her pocket. And my dad, who's 81 years old and just <laughs> says things off the wall sometimes, he says, Julia, one of your basset ears is hanging out. Basset hound ears is hanging out. And my mother's like, Frank, what are you talking about? And he was referring to her pocket being out of her dress, so her basset hound ears. So these, I, I know, I'm like, oh my gosh, you too, you too, you too. But great pockets in this one, so you're absolutely correct. If uh, Barb, if pockets are up your alley, this dress is gonna be perfect for that. All right, so I don't know if y'all read the pin post, but we're also bringing you guys something new and fun um, to the boutique. And that is, I don't know if you've heard of, if you haven't before, um, you need to. They, uh, it is Makeup Junkie. So Makeup Junkie is a line of bags that aren't just cosmetic bags, um, but they are something that you can use for all different kinds of things. They come in four different sizes. Um, at least that's what I'm carrying right now or there are four different sizes. And then the more I was looking, I was like, gosh, there's a whole lot of options and these go up to totes and different things. Um, but Makeup Junkie has been like all the rage lately. And I was so excited again to find something new that I could bring into the shop. And um, that's just something a little bit different. So these are really great because like I said, they are um, or intended or kind of started out as a cosmetic bag, but have since kind of transformed into a whole lot of different things that people use them for. So this is the considered the mini size um, and they're great because you can fill them with different things and throw them in your purse. I'm somebody who I love to have a big purse, but I like to have things in bags. Like I want my lipsticks and my chapsticks in a bag and I want my ibuprofen and my band-aids in bags. And um, I just want to have different bags for different things in within my purse, but I like to carry a really big bag. So I love little things like this that I can throw in there. Um, and Makeup Junkie, they're high quality. They are super cute because they all come with a little tassel on them. Um, a lot of them have different color tassels. The zippers might be different colors. You can see it has their cute little emblem always embroidered or not embroidered, but sewn on the, um, on the bag there. And then they come in just a huge array of different prints. Uh, they're things that people, I was kind of surprised when I heard about them and that people like hunt down certain prints and, uh, different fabrics and that kind of thing, because they are just really super cool and they're fun. So, uh, like I said, they come in four different sizes. So what I did, because it's my first time carrying these, is I did something where I ordered just kind of a mix kit. Uh, so that way I could try them out and see the different fabrics and different textures and that kind of thing before I placed a real real order of um, them to know what I want to carry and to learn about them. So um, this particular one, as you can see, it's a really pretty silver. It comes with that fun hot pink tassel. And then when you open it, they all zip down the middle. And the reason for that is so that they lay flat. Uh, so it's not a makeup bag that's going to like tip over if you're trying to use it, but it lays flat even after you zip it open. And then it just kind of pops open for you to be able to use. So it's really something that's intended so you can kind of peek in there, see everything, not have to dig it all out. But that is why the design of the bag is the way that it is. So this particular one has a really fun lime green interior. You'll see that they really vary depending on the different bags. But something else that's great about them is that they all have, and of course I can't think of the correct word now for what the inside is called but it is all a washable inside so it is um like I don't know if it's a nylon I think it says it in the description Christine Christine's gonna look it up so I have the correct words for you but these all can be wiped out and reused so some things that you can use these bags for and like I said they come in different sizes are you can throw a wet swimsuit in here you can throw a change of your kids clothes in here or a dirty stinky diaper and you have it sealed in there or um you can put throw some extra wipes in here and they're gonna stay wet for you and not leak all over a bag or that kind of thing so it's just something that's really cool people use them for different types of medication 
medications and I, the list goes on and on. I was reading all about it earlier. Even some kids, they're using them for school supplies and different stuff. So you can really get into a lot of different things. But to show you a few of the prints, there's a whole lot of them that are going to be posted on the site tonight. Um, but here's another fun one and kind of a watercolor with your hot pink. Um, and then this one's a little bit of a different texture. It's more of a canvas. And when you open that up, it's got the black inside. Um, but yes, I'm so excited, Kristen, to be carrying these. Ones that I did get in all the sizes in, in multiples were the buffalo plaid. And that was, you know, after you guys got those little buffalo plaid bags and everybody was loving it and buffalo plaid is all the rage this year, I was like, I need to order buffalo plaid. So these I ordered in all four sizes and multiples in them. Um, but my guess is that they won't last long. So these are just so nice, super cute. And if you guys have them, tell us what you use them for. Like Kristen just said, she uses hers all the time. Um, they're something else that's really cute is that you can purchase in addition a little wristlet that you can snap on and you can turn this into a little purse that you can carry around. So you can snap on your wristlet, you can get a coordinating color, and it's just something easy that you can take with you. And of course, depending on what size you wanna carry around, um, but they're just a cute thing and they come in, like I said, so many varieties. Here are some that are a little bit, um, that you can kind of dress up some more. So here's this really cool um, like snake, snake skin texture, and then it has the uh, red zipper, red tie, and then a red inside to it. You guys, they're so fun. It was so fun looking at these and I'm glad I kind of did like I said this kit uh, so that I could see all the different ones this is the large size uh, so as you can kind of see it's a it's generous sizing this you can even throw a wristlet on if you want to be able to carry it around like that or you know take it to the beach and throw in some of your extra things like sunscreen and that kind of stuff it's gonna be nice and protected in there so 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 cute um, they don't come with the wristband, Kathy. That's an add-on item. But we do have wristbands in black, gold, gray, red, and I think white right now. Those are the options. And, oh, yes, here are the other ones to show you. So here's um, black and gold. I pulled out. Oh, show the gray. yeah, Lib's going to show you guys one. But they are just so stinking cute. Look at all these fun different prints that they come in and just the different things you can use them for. So I'm excited to be able to bring these in and kind of get familiarized with them myself and continue to order more of them. So yes, makeup wipes, good color lead. So lots of things. So anyways, I'm excited about Makeup Junkie. And then Lib and I are both in this same outfit. So I'm going to get off camera, but I'll show you mine real quick. And then um, she can go in detail a little bit more. Uh, but is this not cute? Here is a new top that we're bringing in. It's in a super soft um, brushed Hachi. So it's so, so, so soft. One of the softest ones I think we've had yet in this fun animal print. I have it layered here with the gray vest that I know you guys had seen this um, past week. I posted in a couple posts. And this is just fun because it is tiered. So let me give you a little look here. I'm in my true size small. It's a nice length because it's not like a super long tunic length, but it does give me some coverage. Sleeve length is generous, super stretchy. Um, so these I'm going to recommend staying true to size. And then just for a little pop of color, I threw on um, a hot pink earring uh, with this, but that just to show you how you can throw that little bit of color on in an outfit that's really more neutral, you can just get that little pop too. So super fun, um, but cute stuff, you guys. I am loving this one and it's so soft. So I have it on in what we are calling the ivory colorway. Lib does have it on in a little bit of a darker colorway. Um, so the curvy sizes are going to be available in both. It's slightly different. It's not a drastic difference. So when you're looking at stock photos on the site, you might be like, oh, they look so close. So we're calling hers light mocha and this one is ivory. So when she gets close, maybe you can kind of take a look at that and see. Um, the stretch is super nice in this, Cindy. So nice. Nice. So I think that you would be, want your medium, uh, which is kind of what you do in tunic tops, and you're going to be great. So, so cute. Okay. So, as Rachel had mentioned, I have this on in the mocha. And you see, it's very, very different. And in fact, from like, sorry, very, very close. Do you want to see close side by side, maybe? Do you see? It's very <laughs> slight. <laughs> I don't even think they can tell. Maybe you guys you can see, tell a little bit. There's a very slight, very slight difference. This is creamer, and then this is the mocha. Well, yeah, it's not it's, creamer. It's ivory. Yeah, more ivory. Yeah, and this is light, light, light mocha. But if you did, if you were looking at them next to each other, it'd be like, huh, are these the same? But they, that's how close they are. But it's just good to know that you, they have both of them that way. Um, and I have both of these on in the three. Uh, this is that great jacket that you have seen before, but you may have not seen it in the curvy size. Um, I probably would not uh, zip this one up. 
uh, but I would let it, uh, you know, just kind of fall the way it is. But it has the um, little toggles that can kind of make a little bit more of a waist on there too, which is fun. Um, and then it also has that fantastic hood too. And in this case, this mocha goes like very well uh, with this, this match is very close to one another there. Um, so let's see here. This is the, um, moving on up leopard tiered tunic. And then this is the mocha with the leopard. And as you can see, it's actually falling at my natural waist. So this is right where my natural waist is and that's where it's falling. And these jeans that I have on are just about two inches lower than that. Um, and this is the black, what jeans do I have on actually? I just put them on with the black king cans, high rise skinny jeans, um, with a black flat. I'm sorry if I went back and I read, let me see here. Um, Ooh, Nicole, that's a good question. That's a stumper. She lost the toggle in the washer. Where can she get one? You can actually buy them in pairs at Joann's. So I would take off the other one. And then take off the other one and have a matching pair again. You can buy them at Joann's. Jo Joann Fabrics? I think, every, I mean, yeah, those are I national think, yeah, chain, yeah. right? Okay. Amazon, oh my gosh, you can Amazon Prime it right now and have it on the whatever the heck day it is. God only knows. You don't have to leave the house for anything. <laughs> oh my gosh. But uh, I do like where this is hitting. So it's, you know, you could wear it with a legging, but I think that for me... I would still do it with a jean, and so that's why we've paired it here with these can cans. Um, but just a great fun top, and just wanted to mention that it falls at my natural waist, and then the tears go down from there. But a lot of great stretch in there, but also like without feeling sloppy. I love it. It's a really fun one. Um, the other thing that I wanted to mention is just another one of these uh, makeup junkie bags that's kind of in this cool, like oh my gosh, it's a velour, but it just goes nicely with the. Um, it goes nicely with the leopard and I've got two other straps to just show you with this gray and then also the white Rachel had shown you the black one and the red one and then there was a gold one too um, in fact I got them right here I'll just kind of line them all up for an idea for adding that little wristlet see how this size like makes like a fun you know it's like an easy piece where you could just put a card and some money and a lipstick in there and then that's easy easy peasy ready to go type of thing um, but that great inside on these is just wonderful I did not know much about these bags, so we're all learning a lot of, uh, you know, all together at once, basically. Um, but this is a great top, and fantastic that it comes in the full-size run for all of us. And a nice piece that's not going to be too heavy, but it's going to be a nice layering piece, or nice for uh, inside of a warm house, too. I just, I want to pull out all of these bags and show them to you all, but you'll have to see them on the site. But this is another fun, cute one too. I'm just like digging through here and I'm like, oh, this could be cute with my outfit. This pretty coral with a fun texture to it. It's got a contrasting teal zipper. I just love these. And then it's got a fun little uh, silver tassel on it and a silver inside. So a little surprise what you get on the inside, um, but they are just so fun. So next up, I think Christy already posted, I am in this fun contrast raglan style top. Um, it is baby suede, so nice and soft, nice and stretchy. And this is fun because you get the floral plus the stripe, which we love that pattern mixing. Like I said, I'm kind of on a mission for um, more prints uh, to kind of carry us into spring. I mean, we're talking spring, but yet it, we're not even in January. Like we haven't even hit winter, it seems like. Um, but I'm hopeful, I guess, that spring will come. Um, but it also has the fun elbow pattern patches here. So you get that fun detail here in the contrast um, with the floral. So it is just a cute style top. Again, raglan, if you're not familiar with what a raglan is, it's when you kind of get that baseball style tee. Um, and then these are just a, they're nice, loose, kind of flowy fit. So similar to like our go-to tee style, where it's a little bit more fitted up top and then roomy in the body. Um, I would say very similar fit to the go-to tee if you've tried one of those um, and you know the flow. I would say it's very, very similar. You can stay in the same size, but they're just a really great roominess, especially for those um, of us who put on some weight during Christmas. I keep wanting to call it like the freshman 15, but I'm like, <laughs> I gotta come up with something Christmas-wise that's like my Christmas 15, but that's catchy. So if any of you know or have something that you say when it's Christmas season and you pack on the pounds. I need to know what it is because that's like what I'm doing right now. And we're like January 1st. Right? So I think everybody's on that mission. So I paired this um, with some yellow earrings just to kind of bring up the little pops of yellow wherever that is in here. There's some yellow tones. 
So just a little fun contrast. And then I have these paired with the Judy Blue Shark Bite um, ankle length uh, ankle length jeans. So these are a little bit shorter. Um, they're intended to be because they are meant to be ankle length. Um, so they the Shark Bite kind of hits me a little bit above like my natural ankle. I'm 5'7". But for you shorter ladies who are kind of concerned sometimes with the real long length, this would be a great pair for you to kind of try. Of course, they'll be a little bit longer on you, but um, they're not going to be where they're too long and draggy at the bottom. But I just love how, kind of the rough edge to them, the distressing, and they're Judy Blues, so they're so comfortable. I'm in my true Judy Blues um, 728 size, and these hit me just about at my belly button, so they're considered a mid-rise, but like I kind of talked with some of you, the Judy Blue mid-rise and even the Can Can mid-rises are a little bit more of a high-rise pant. They don't hit you way up on your natural waistline high-rise, but they're not... Um, um, where we're getting into that like um, college days of midi or mid mid rise that just hit us to a little bit lower and you have to worry about things hanging out so these kind of are great length or great great inseam no yeah. great yeah. rise great. so that way things are kind of tucked away and um where we don't want to see them. So anyways, I just love this outfit. It's easy, cute to throw on a vest with this, um, even a cardigan, but then you lose seeing your sleeve. But it's just a really great piece. Absolutely love this. Lib is going to show it to you in another colorway, and they're just so cute. So I'm going to go change. I think I have a couple more things to show you. You got one more? I have two. Okay. I am also having equal love for this top. <laughs> The background is that great Marsala with the matching stripe with the ivory. And I would say it's an ivory, not a white. I mean, it's reading ivory to me. But I have this on in the three. I also have the same shark fight jeans on as well, um, which I love. You know, typically this maybe not be an outfit where I'm like, oh my gosh, I like the distress on these jeans. I like the kind of sportiness to the raglan top. I like the different print mi mixing, you know, but it's absolutely fun. It's very effortless. It's an easy one to put together and still be very comfortable. It's a great weight of a very um, soft baby suede. And I think that this is actually like, I put the whole look together in front of the mirror in the other room and I'm like, that's cute. I really like that together. Um, so I'll just give you a spin here so you can see where it is falling on me. Um, but I really am liking this. Also the sleeves are not too long um, and the fun detailing on the elbow. So these great elbow patches that are surged on too that match the same print, of course, as the bodice. So it's just a really fun, fun mixing together. I'll get to a little bit closer here so you have an idea of the colors that we are dealing with. Rachel had pulled that yellow out with a mustard earring, um, but you could also do that. I threw on kind of like a champagne colored earring because that's a little bit more of a neutral, but also fun to pull, you know, those colors in here too. But I really am, I really actually... I don't want to say that sometimes I surprise myself about things that once I actually have it on, I'm like, I like that a heck of a lot more than I thought I did, but I definitely do like this one. So, um, the long sleeve is great and it's a full ride, a uh, full run size in, this is the rust Rachel had on what is called blush. the blush. Yeah. So, uh, this one just is a little bit more Marsala-y and a little bit deeper tones where hers was a little bit more, uh, you know, you, well, you just saw it, so I don't have to tell you <laughs> specifically, but two fantastic colorways, but also great, uh, you know, pattern mixing on those as well. So, um, how tall? Yeah, five, seven to five, eight, you know, somewhere along that, that way in there. And then I have this on in the three and then I have the, uh, shark bite jeans on in the three, two, I believe. 20 that's right I'm sorry I'm thinking can cans these are Judy Blues I have them on in the 20 so perfect yeah and you guys um I am working my tail off trying to find things in full size runs because I know that that's easier for all of us it's easier for you guys when you um see a picture and you love it and you're not disappointed that it's not available so I am working so hard and then I think I find everything in full sizes and then I get like an out of stock in in um you know the curvy sizes or out of stock in the regular sizes so that's something that I'm kind of struggling with is really finding I guess companies that don't surprise me with those out of stock but I'm working super hard trying to get full sizes and everything. So please know that that is the goal. That's the end goal is that I will be able to carry everything in small through 3XL and preferably an extra small if the day comes that I'm able to get everything in those sizes too. So um, I just wanted to show you guys um, another one of those fitted tees real quick. Uh, so this is the beautiful fuchsia cut shade in that. And I just loved it with this... Um, 
this sweater jacket. So this is one that you guys have seen before and I know I posted a picture in my group the other day in it, but it is one of my favorite pieces. I absolutely love this and I love it with the pop of color um, with this. And then again, your fun pop of color with earrings. It's just something that really ties the outfit together. So this is the, the other shade available in the V-neck in the fitted tees. These really are great layering pieces. They're great for under graphic tees if you like to layer a long sleeve under that because they're more fitted in the sleeve. And they're just great to, I mean, they're great to wear alone. Um, you guys all know that I've been a fan of fitted tees for a very long time. I'm kind of obsessed with them and I can easily become obsessed with these as well. That's how much I love them and I love the fabric and the fit and the feel of them. So definitely make sure to scope these out. And like I said, there's something if y'all like, then I'll definitely bring them in in more colors and in more options and that kind of thing. But I absolutely love it and I love this color. And it's just great with those, um, the just the pop with like the black and the ivory on that. So I, it's something that I love. So I think we have one more little outfit change for you. Um, Lib is getting changed. Maybe I should. Should I run over there and try to change or? Yeah, they need to see you in that. Well, they, I know. Oh. I didn't want to leave them alone. Oh! <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys some more makeup junkie bags. And this one that like matches my fuchsia top here perfectly. How fun is this? You guys, they're so fun. So this one is another, I think this one is called a gator print. If my friend Charlene's still on here, she um, is like the queen of makeup junkie bags. And so I was messaging her like, what are the names of these? And she knew them all. It was fabulous. Um, but yes, these are so cool. So this one, I absolutely love this with the um, fuchsia and the black and just that gator. So cool, you guys. So these come in so many. I mean, how different are these? You know, these are both the size large through, but they're so different, which means that they suit so many different people's likings and styles and preferences. Some of us are floral and some of us are a gator, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so it's just fun that there are so many different things, but there are a lot of those for you guys to shop and browse tonight. And I'm excited to bring more in. So I'm going to change so I can catch up to Lib and I'll be out in a second. Okay. So pajamas. <gasps> That like, it's not just like a jogger and a, and a graphic tee. Like this is a full on pajama set and um, a contrasting sleeve on here. And you'll also note that that's along the collar on the V-neck. And then it also has that same cuff that is at the uh, bottom. Lots of nice room in here. Like these are the type of pajamas that I would be like, well, I could actually wear these as pajamas as opposed to like, oh, I'll take a family picture in these and then not wear them as pajamas, right? Um, but this is a fun, <coughs> excuse me, fun uh, pairing together. I think that they are definitely roomy. What I do love also is that there is a pocket, a working pocket on the left, the left butt cheek here. So that's helpful. Um, but I'm liking the room that I have in here. Lots of great room in the bust, room in the arms, um, a very generous sleeve length, but very easy to push up without like having a um, elastic in there that might like tourniquet something, honestly, to tell you the truth. But you could also wear these obviously two pieces together, but if you wanted to, you could pull this top as a top that you wear under something with a pair of jeans or vice versa with a black top or a colored top of some sort if you wanted to wear the pants for going out for a walk or going to the gym or something along those lines. So I think that it's a very versatile, very fun together, but also nice to just have uh, something where the top matches the bottom, if that's ever been something that's bothered you about any of the other kind of like things before. Rachel's putting earrings on for her pajamas. <laughs> I'm just telling you. She's back here like, look at my earrings. I wear my earrings to bed. Oh, so. she does. <laughs> Lord. She does. I'm sure well, she Well, because does. I fall asleep. I'm yes, like in true. random well, places. And she falls yep. asleep like on things while she's trying to ship and do things, answer your questions. <laughs> so I'm not surprised she wears her earrings to bed. Um, but yes, as you can see, so I have this on in the three. Great amount of room in the leg, and um, you could pull this up to have it be kind of like a slouchy look if you wanted to do it that way as opposed to being all down, but um, not I, I'm a great amount of length. So like if you are taller, I don't think you would have any problem with these, but if you are shorter, they have that cuff on there so you could just shorten them up a bit. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, like them. They're super cool. They so, are cute. Yeah, I'm absolutely loving these two, you guys. So I'm in my true size small in both pieces. Um, I didn't hear Lib kind of get started. I was focusing on what earrings I was going to well, put on. I told them about the butt pocket. Oh, yeah. Oh, also, I want to mention oh, the, butt the buttons. There's three buttons down the uh, front here, and they are not working. They're so just, those, are just, those are there. 
Those are just for show. Those are there. Yeah. So um, they have a nice stretchy waistband yes. in them, the elastic. So I'm in my true size small. They do sit, I'd say, like a higher rise. You know, they're just above yep. my belly button to, in a comfortable place. I mean, they're very comfortable. Yes. That back pocket that Lib talked to you about. Mm -hmm. These are a French terry um, and probably like a medium them. weight French terry. Mm -hmm. So it's not really heavy, but it's going to be one that this is cozy and comfy for these months. Yeah. Um, where it's not going to be too hot if you're somebody who you get, you know, really warm you're still gonna be okay in this you'll be fine but yeah like Lib said these are considered a lounge top and lounge pant so you can wear them separately you can wear them together I mean how cute They're is this cute. especially like if you have company over if you're taking a girls weekend and you want to have a fun pair of jammies but still be comfortable and modest and covered oh, yeah. and I, I mean that. I just absolutely love that and like she said you can wear them separate um you can wear them to run errands I mean I, I would totally there, wear there these to no run errands reason you couldn't wear one of these things <laughs> or both oh, I, I would I wear mean, them together seriously, you could oh my gosh together <gasps> yeah someone call 911 fashion place <laughs> just kidding um i left the house in something crazy today and i ran into a bunch of people so i can't i'm not next time speak, my but... son calls me like that he's sick at school i'm gonna go pick him up just show and, up and like, the... mom, yeah like our mom used to you know <laughs> drop me off in her robe because I made her get out of the car to drop me off and so she's like if I go in my robe she won't make me get out of the car and walk her in and you would make her oh, still get out yeah Rachel I, <laughs> I wasn't pleasant sorry mom I wasn't if you're pleasant watching. That's too funny. but yes <laughs> but the, yes the pieces are very cute together but they also could be yeah definitely fun separate. and I love the ankles I love yes. that little cuff at the ankle um not cuff yes yes cuff. Yes. Yeah, the little band down there. And then there, it, match, so. it matches the so, same uh, yeah, sleeve Yeah, so here, they're just super the cute. Here. I'd say stay true, stay true to size and Absolutely. We both are very comfortable in our true to size. So. so, And you can be Twinkies. Woo! Yeah. yeah. So if you and your best, you want to get matching pajamas and matching <laughs> earrings, you can. But, all right. Well, I think that kind of rounds up tonight's live. So we're going to go ahead and get inventory loaded. We will comment both here um, and in the group that inventory is loaded. It takes me a little time to get all those pictures loaded to the group um, with the direct links, but I will get that done. Usually it's like by morning um, that I get that accomplished. Just so you guys can go ahead and begin your shopping, your browsing. Make sure to look under the accessories tab for the makeup junkie bags. I have added a new category for those, um, so they'll be specifically there. If you have questions, make sure to let us know. Christine's here to help. Liberty's here to help. I'm here. So if anybody has questions, let us know. Um, but Happy New Year. Yes. I might wear this out tomorrow Actually, night. Actually, this would be This might be my New Year's outfit. So yeah, I hope you all um, enjoy your New Year's, have some champagne, and look forward to 2020. Uh, kind of a fresh start, right? That's what we all look yes, forward to. Yes, 2020 so, is upon us. It is. So a new decade and new beginnings. But have have a great night. Happy shopping, and we'll see y'all soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.